so here when i finalized the website and when i tried to fill out this form and i click on the button so i saw this error so this error occur when you create a form using any plugin and then there is some issue in the server so then this error occur on your website so in this video we will see how to fix this error so i have opened the elementor editor and i have created this form using elementor so so i will tell you how to fix it but you can fix it is with the same procedure if you were using any other form plugin so here let's try to create a form so here you see the same error again so this is the server error so for this we will need to set up smtp server so i will show you that completely in the video so for this you will need to go to your web hosting so i am using symbol host so i will go to that and i will log in so i will tell you the procedure from c panel so you can just log in to your c panel account and then everything is same in c panel c panel is same in like all of the hostings so you can log in to your c panel so here you will need to create an email account so for that you can search for email so here you see email account so you have to click on that and here you will have to create an email for your website so you will click on create and here select the domain so i was working on kashifmehmood.com so i will select that and here write the username so if you want to create an email like let me show you so if you want to create an email like info at the rate your domain name dot com or whatever it is so if you want to create add info before your email so then you can just write info over here and if you want to use any other like your name or contact at the rate or something like that then you can just write that over here so this will be your professional business email so if you want you will you can connect that to your gmail as well that i will show in the end so here you will have to write the password for your email so just write a strong password and save it in any file so i have write a strong password and i will click on edit setting and here you can give any space to your email so i will just give it 256 mb of space and i, I will click on create so now my email is created here you can see and when i if i want to send email to this one then i can also send that and i will be able to receive and check emails over here so here you will have to click on open so here you can see a configuration message as well so this is a configuration message that we currently don't need so we will now go to our website and we will have to log into the dashboard and now we will have to install a new plugin so we will have to write smtp so we will install this very fast plugin activate let's get started and here you have to scroll down and click on other smtp save and continue so here you will have to write your domain name so i will write mine so here is the port number so now here you will have to write the smtp username so here you can write your email that that you just created so i will just copy the email and i will paste it over here and then i will have to write the password that i settled while creating the email so i have written the password and now here you have to write the email again save and continue scroll down you can save it oh, and you can click on save and continue again
so here you can write any of your personal email or maybe the same one so you can click on save and continue skip this setup so here we have successfully set up our WP Wales SMTP and now we will click on send a test email and here you can write any of your email to receive a test email so you can confirm if it's working or not so I will click on send email so here you can see the email is sent and now if I go to the email account so here you can see I have received the test email successfully so now I will go to the website and now I will fill the form again so you can see it is sent successfully and this one is now working as well so that's how you can set up SMTP server and fix this error and if you want to connect the email that you just created with your Gmail so you will receive all of the emails on your Gmail then you can watch this video I will provide the link of the video in the description of the video so thank you for watching see you next time